looks like there's no line for the Independence Liberty Bell. That's great. What's up, everybody? This is Bacon Chris here, and today I'm back again at Historic Philadelphia. Checking out some other historic sites. And today, I'm going to the U.S. Mint and the Federal Reserve. So, and if you don't know what the Mint or the Federal Reserve is, it's where money is made. So let's check out the city. Time to get into TSA. Remember this. Yep, there's the Liberty Bell, and then there's Independence Hall. Decided to stop at Wawa and get a hot chocolate for myself, and I got cookies and cream with whipped cream. Gotta have a have Wawa. Hot chocolate over here, but I'm getting the specialty hot chocolate. I just got the cookies and cream or hot chocolate. This hot chocolate tastes way better than the stuff you get from a Swiss Miss hot chocolate pack. Really good hot cocoa. I wish they would have white chocolate hot cocoa. That tastes really good. And I'm over at the Independence Park Square. And I'm back again. But I'm not going to Independence Hall this time. Yep. Here I am again. And there's the Barry statue. Dogs. Love dogs. Barry. Commodore John Barry. said I was going to go to the Federal Reserve earlier. Well, I can. Ah, oh, it feels so nice in Philadelphia. There's the Independence Beer Garden, and it's closed for today. We got an Independence Visitor Center. There's the gift shop. Mmm, fudge. Sorry. Go sex search. And yep, you remember this museum. I am right here. The Federal Reserve is a building that takes care of like the dollar bills. I think they make it, but what they do instead is they shred up bills and that gets recycled into new money. So a dollar bill lasts for like 22 months, I believe. And basically, they shred it and make new ones out of it. This is the Federal Reserve Bank in Philadelphia. And then we'll go to the U.S. Mint. This is it, the Federal Reserve.
Well, that was fun while it lasted, but unfortunately, filming was not permitted in the exhibits. So I'm gonna go head over to the US Mint now. All right, here's the US Mint where they make the money. Let's check out what's inside the mint. Just got out of the mint and unfortunately it's raining and they wouldn't allow me to film at the mint, including taking photography. But at the Federal Reserve, I was permitted to take photography. So let's go get some. Today I decided not to go to Pat's King of Steaks because I am getting tired of it. Plus, I'm gonna go somewhere else to get a cheesesteak, like Campos or I don't know where else. Friday, right, so I decided to go to Penn's Landing a bit. See what there is there. Yep, you remember Betsy Ross house. Not today, Betsy. Plus filming's not permitted. I think for my cheesesteak, I like to go to Campos and maybe get some french fries over a Chickies and Pete's or, or get some ice cream at Franklin Fountain. Let's see, so many decisions. Let's go to Campos Cheesesteaks. Give something new a try. It looks very nice. Just got my cheesesteak. And... Well, oh, I had Campos good. at... the Phillies game, but I never had, like, a real steak from Campos. So, give this a try. But in the meantime, let's stop over at... Franklin Fountain. Right over at Franklin Fountain, I just got myself a root beer float with vanilla ice cream. Back again, Pun's Landing. Crossing the South Street Bridge. Right, this is the opening of the Campos cheesesteak, and I can't wait to try it. So, this is a regular cheesesteak with onions and American cheese. There's not too many people at Penn's Landing here today. And the event's closed, or will open later. There's Walt Whitman up ahead. Sooner or later, it'll be Sixers time. It's like Liberty Point is closed for the season or not too many customers are here. Yep, they're closed. Wonder if Chickies is open today. Oh, leaves are falling down. And places are closed. I bet Chickies and Pete's will be closed too. There's Chickies and Pete's, but I think that they're closed for today. Or they're probably closed for the yep, season. Yep, no Chickies and Pete's today. Sadly. So, let's just go home. Train's going underneath the Ben Franklin Bridge. Sadly, no chickies and peas today. Hey folks, that's about it for Bacon Chris Adventures, where I went to the Mint and the Federal Reserve, and then went to Penn's Landing again. Another historic day in Philadelphia.
that type of trip. So it's time for me to go home. Got to catch the bus home. And I will see you guys in the next adventure.